Hello and welcome to another edition of Footprint. Today we are here to um, walk through the footprints of a wonderful gentleman, somebody who, who indeed blazed the trail of dancing. I will not uh, go ahead of myself. We'll have to watch this video. When we come back, we'll be zooming straight into the life of this gentleman. My name is Samuel Atamensa and welcome to the program. Accra born Ajete Sowa is one of the most known dance exponents of the disc era. After winning the national dance championship in the 80s, he decided to move to the United Kingdom to partake in the world dance championship. His inimitable dance style would see him crowned world dance champion by 1986. Ajete Sowa tells the rest of his story on Footprints Now. Welcome back to the program, and I'm half with him here, um, the man Ajete Soa. Ajete, yeah. it's good to have you here. Oh, thank you. Nice one. Nice one. Uh, so, where have you been hiding? Well, I was out of the country for a while. Yes. Yeah, but now I'm here to You're stay. here. Now you live in Ghana. So, you, then you've been away for, for a, a very long time. Yeah, I was away for almost... Almost 20 years. 15 to 20, yeah, 15 yeah, to 17 that's years. That's a long time. Yeah. And you, that, that, that would have taken you to, to the US? Or UK? Yeah, I was in the US, yeah. You were in the US? Traveling all over, UK, Switzerland. Oh, okay. The US, but I'm still okay. more in the US. So, you, so you, you've been, you haven't been quiet, you've been active. Yeah. Doing your own thing. You know, like it is. <laughs> wow. It's good to have you, Ajit. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Um, so, um, here we have Ajete Soa with us, and um, for those of you under the age of um, 25, 30, the name Ajete Soa may, may just sound like uh, another one, mm. but let's see who he really is. Ajete, so where, where are you from? You are Ga, obviously, but where mm. are you from? From Ga, Teshi. Oh, Teshi. Teshi. Why did I always think you were from Labadi? Uh, but maybe because of the name, because uh, Labadi, Teshi so, uh, have almost the same, same name. names. You know, okay. You know, the, I think the Labadi, Teshi, the name come from Labadi and then yeah, Teshi. And then Teshi. You know. Of course, yeah. La and Teshi, Teshi people, yeah, are, yeah, you know what they share. Yeah. Good. Tell me, where, where, your, your, your beginning, where did you start schooling? I started uh, school in uh, Lincoln, that's in Teshi. Lincoln oh, International, Teshi International yeah. School. Teshi Nungai State, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's where I started. Yeah, you, oh, so you you were that about from beginning? Not really, Charlie. Hustler. <laughs> Hustler in Lincoln Hustler, International Hustler. School. Yeah, International School. Because Hustler. those days, to be yeah. in International, international School, school it's, not, it's not easy. Yeah, but then, you know, my dad did well by doing that, you know. No matter what, but he was like, okay, you okay. guys have to take your education that serious. Mm -hmm. But I get to your point, I wasn't that serious in school because of the, you know, dance. Because you were skillful in other areas. Mm -hmm. But I mean, to say that you were not that serious, but you were able to, you know, rock the common entrance and, and then find your way to... I to think that's by, by the grace of God I did that. <laughs> <laughs> so how, how, at which point did you realize that you were talented with dancing? Uh, I think when I was in class six. Mm -hmm. Because there was a what do you call at Lincoln. it at Lincoln. There was a cultural group which I have to be the leader of the group. There was a traditional cultural group. I have to be the leader. And that's when I realized that hey, then I'm good because to be the leader of the you know. Mm -hmm. So that's when I realized. So this that, is a hey, school cultural a, group. Yeah, traditional yeah mm -hmm. school cultural group. So and mostly you know, guard dance forms. Or? Not really guard dance. You know traditional dance. So it can be Ewe dance, Awuza okay. dance. You know traditional dance. So we mm -hmm. do all kinds of dance. Yeah. Yeah. And so you found your talent right there. So I there. found my talent right there. And I can say my talent comes from my father because he used to be a dancer, you know, back oh, in the days. Oh, your Rock father used to my dance? Father. Yeah, he's very, very good. Was he part Rock of a road. group? Yeah, back in the days. I can't remember the name, but then okay. he was the leader of a group of rock and roll dance, you know. Oh, rock yeah. and roll. Rock and roll. This would be in the 60s. In the and 60s, the, you know, yeah. 60s, in the 50s, 60s, yeah. Wow, wow. So, so you, you, you didn't make a mistake. Yeah, yeah. You can say that. And then you went to Laboni Secondary School. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, which year was that? 80, 1980. Mm -hmm. 1980. That's when I realized that, hey, Charlie. You know, most of the clubs, 
is around Laboni. Osu Laboni. Osu Laboni, KTK, Black so, Caesar. So, Black. So, so let me take it one. You went to Form 1 in Laboni in mm -hmm. 1980. Mm -hmm. And um, you, you went there to go and study. Mm -hmm. And then you noticed that there were other things that were taking your attention. Is, mm -hmm. that, is that right? Yeah. I think the first, uh, what do you call it? Uh, we have an entertainment night or something yes. like that. Uh, we call it almost night. Almost night, And then yes. you have to come and perform or something mm -hmm. like that. And uh, I think I did my thing, and people really love it. And yeah. since then, I realized, hey, Charlie, Every I day. have to go out there and make some money out of it. <laughs> <laughs> so that Homos Night, mm -hmm. that year group of 1980, mm -hmm. you remember some of them? Of course. Some of the names. Oh. Those who eventually became your disciples. Uh-huh, your Mokwashi, number one. Patuna. Patuna, Patuna. <laughs> Uh, mm -hmm. Let me say, away. Away stay. Away stay, uh, yeah. How about Slicky T? Slicky T, yeah. Slicky T, too, yeah. You remember him? Yeah, I remember. He worked with the bankers, one of the bank. Um, hmm. I'm not sure. I'm not sure about Slicky mm, T's Slicky T. Yes, availability now. I'm yes, not so sure yeah. where he is, but um, yes, time, yeah. yeah. And and any any other names? Hmm. I can't remember, but then these are the names that Gino. I Gino. Gino, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, because you know, I, I, I came to Laboni, continued where you left off. So yeah. I came to sit for when you had finished uh, Form 5. So, wow. so, so most of your mates became my mates. Oh, okay. <laughs> so that's how come I remember the names the like name that. Mm -hmm. them. Okay. So your, 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 you remember the entertainment prefect? Can I remember? I don't know if it's Aito or. I, do you know the name Aito? No. No, I don't know uh -huh. if it's Aito. I can't remember, you know. Mm -hmm. But I remember this name Aito. It's ahead of me, I think a year or something. Oh, okay. Yeah. But when you went And then we have one. a guy called Ampia, which, you know, this guy is so wicked. <laughs> <laughs> he used to punish everybody. But because of my dance, it's like, okay, you, I get to stay here. Stay here. Yeah, you're, let you're, me my finish guy. The you're my guy. Let me finish the guy. Yeah. And when you went to Form 1, who was the headmaster, you remember? In Lahoni. Is it Mr. Lamte? Mr. Lamte. Uh, yeah, Mr. Lamte Mr. was Lamte. there before. Yeah, Mr. Lamte. Um, before, is it Mr. Hackman or something? I can't remember. But Uchiama was there, right? Uchiama was there, yeah. He Mr. Was Uchiama. Sports, Mr. Uchiama was the sports, sports, yeah. sports, sports master. Yeah, sports master. Um, he, he is my uncle. I can say my uncle. Oh, so, oh, so yeah. Awe is your cousin? Yeah, well, yeah. Oh, nice. Uncle, yeah. And um, Laboni, any mm. memories? Remember Otto? Otto Fista. <laughs> <laughs> Otu, Otu. <laughs> Otu, I mean, Otu. I don't think anybody passed through Laboni Would in I'm, the eighties. You know, you who forgets Otu? Otu, Otu, Otu. <laughs> hey, Charlie. Good. So you, you, you have good memories about being oh, in Laboni Secondary Laboni School. Too, yeah, of course. Because I remember, you know, when I was in Form Three, I have to run away from school, you know, in the night to go to the clubs because the clubs is around. Yeah. And then one day I came back and it was like, okay, Ajete, you, we know you can dance and all that, and you'll be skipping school and stuff like that. So you know what? It's better you become a day student. Day student. Chai! So from, from three, I think from third year, you know. Third term. Yeah. Third term, yes. Mm -hmm. I'm third term, I have to become a day student, you know. Because that's when, you know, my, I think my day yeah, started. Because that was, and I was this making, will be around 83. 83, yeah. Good. Yeah, 83, yeah. Wow. And I was making money out of it. So because of that, I was like, oh, you know, I mean, the future is about money, you know, to make so money. Why so not? why don't, you know, why, wh what is all about this education? Tell me, me do my thing and make my money. <laughs> so did you continue to, to the end with you education? School? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, did, I finished from five, but yeah, I, can, I, can, it, yeah. I, can, I can I can tell you, I wasn't that serious. You know, I came to... Well, you were serious uh, with what the music. Call, with the dance and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah. And then, uh, what do you call it, from five... I came to, uh, I think I just want to fill the, uh, what do you call it? The, uh, the school environment. The school environment. Not the school environment. Uh, you know, we have, uh, what do you call it? Whole level. The, yeah, the whole, whole level. level. The yeah. exams, what do you call, we call uh, Yeah, GC. GC, level, yeah. yeah. So, mm -hmm. GC, I just came, you know, sit down. Just also think pass the, through the, that thing. Yeah, first paper, I can't remember what is English or whatever. I just look at it and I'm like, nah, man, let me get out. <laughs> and that very night, I was going to London, so I'm like, oh, Charlie. <laughs> wow! So yeah. you went through five years mm -hmm. of education. Yeah, but and for, uh, let me say for three, uh, two years I was that serious. But from from three going to form five, Charlie. 
it became you know, it became business a, fest. Business fest, you know, I was traveling all around the country. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I come but to school, instead of books, you know, it's like with money, just because chilling around with my friends. Yeah, yeah. And your friends were following you everywhere. Yeah, everywhere, everywhere, you know. It was like Ajiti and the disciples. Yeah. But I can say I regret, I regret doing that because... Really? I mean, education is more serious. I can take the full speed. Well, but it didn't turn out badly. Uh, like I said, by the grace of God. Yeah, it didn't turn yeah. out badly. I mean, of course, you're not going to tell your children not to skip, you know, yeah. not to skip school. Mm -hmm. um, but talent led you in a different yeah. direction. Yeah, I mean, in other countries, that would have still given you a proper future, if you like. Yeah. You know, so... Um, finished O level, and um, did you did you try getting back into formal education? At no, 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 really. Okay, so that's fine. We we will now go back to your dance experiences. Mm -hmm. Indeed, that's what makes Ajeto Soa who he is. I mean, for those who finished their form fives and their sixth forms at the universities. We still don't remember them, but you will remember. Mm -hmm. So you didn't turn on badly. Mm -hmm. So what was your first encounter in the dancing contest? That was Babylon 83. Babylon 83. The, okay. I, think I won so, that one. Mm -hmm. and then so Babylon, yeah. Babylon used to be a club. It's a club. A but club. It's, at the same time, it used to be a club. But then it's like regional national dancing competition. Yeah. Those days, we don't have embassy double do. Yeah. But then all the clubs do it in their various regions. Uh, regions and then yeah, you know, at the funnels, then everybody have to come to... The funnels of funnels, everybody have to come to Babylon. Okay, so so this is it. We had like a league mm -hmm. where uh, people did dancing competitions Competition. in their areas, in their areas in which is the uh, communities, and then they move to the regions, regions, and then there's a national one. National one yeah. Okay, so did you do anything within your community? Yeah. Well, let me say, uh, for me, I don't know, but then uh, 82, I watched, uh, what do you call it? Uh, there was uh, 82, I think G-Man. Yeah, G-Man. Yeah, that's guy when G-Man had come G -Man. back. So yeah. I saw G-Man doing his thing, and he won Babylon 82. Too. That's so I was correct. like, okay, then that's where, uh, you know, that's my next <laughs> target. Target, you know. So. Yeah. I mean, G-Man was miles ahead of the rest because he had come in and he was gaining skills that we didn't know about. Yeah, about, yeah, yeah. You know. He was doing Michael Jackson, basically. You know. Yeah. Yes. But he dressed like Michael, Michael Jackson, Jackson, did his hair like Michael mm -hmm. Jackson, everything, everything like yeah. Jackson. Mm -hmm. But you came Teshi boy. Yeah. But you're here, what? Sally, you know, <laughs> coming out with my own skills. Yes. Stuff like that. Because uh, I was the first guy, let me say, these days people are doing mixing, you know, but I was the first guy I was like, look, to win this competition, I have to come out with something different, you know, something that is not just uh, music. But So I used 10 artists, so, uh, song, different which, songs, with different mixed songs, together. which I mixed it together yeah. to create something new. Mm -hmm. So this is Babylon. That was so, Babylon. I mean, look, I the people it. watching that, some of them don't even understand this Babylon thing. Mm -hmm. So, Babylon was a club was in Laboni. Yeah, in Laboni. Yeah. Um, the same place that is now the Chinese restaurant called Hinlon. Oh, okay. Uh, Hinlon, next to the SDA school. Mm -hmm. This is opposite Laboni Secondary opposite, School. Yeah, kind yes, of, yeah. Opposite, yeah. So, this is where the finals came. Yeah. If you're a good dancer, you have to be part of that, you know. Well, there were not many of them good dancers. Hey, there were a lot of dancers. There was a lot of dancers. I mean, good dancers. We have Resi, Gabi Ajete is there, Akosia Japan was there. So, so let, me, let me go back to 83. 83 mm -hmm. finals. Mm -hmm. Let's try and name some of the people, if you mm -hmm. remember. Okay. 83. 83, the name that I remember, that would be, for Babylon, I can't remember, but then Caesar 83. Okay, Caesar. Caesar was a bit later. Yeah. Later, you know, I think uh, two months later. But that was um, Reggie, right? Reggie, right, yeah. yeah. Uh, that was two months later before... After Babylon, mm -hmm. I won Babylon, so there yeah. was another one like, you know. The national, national, national yeah, yes. whatever it is. That was, mm -hmm. it's all 83. Yeah. But then, uh, let me put it this way. Uh, Babylon have his horn. Yeah. And, and then Black Caesar, Caesar too started, you know, two months later, they also started. Just like uh, these days, we have um, uh, Miss, Ghana, Miss Ghana. And then, then we have Miss, uh, Malaika. Miss Malaika or Miss yeah. Lost, most beautiful. Yeah. Miss something, something. Yeah, something yeah. Like so. Okay, so 
some of the names that you mentioned, mm -hmm. if you can go through them, mm -hmm. Gabi Ajete used to yeah. dance. He used to dance. But not. I mean, since 83. Yeah, yeah. You can say that time. You know, Gabi used to dance? Yeah, Gabi was a very good dancer too. <laughs> Kosia Jepo. Akosia Jepo. Reggie Rakstow. Reggie. Frederick Owusu. Frederick? Yeah. Man, we used to live Carlos together Alberto. in Coco Beverly. Carlos Alberto. Yeah. Um, yeah. Who else? Mm. Um, this boy. Um, Donata. Donata, yeah. Donata. Donata, yeah. Donata, yeah. Donata who later yeah. became a presenter at yeah. TV3. TV3 yeah. um, Donata was not part of, I think Donata was part of 84. 84, right? 84, yeah. Okay. 84, I, I remember him within that space. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, so this is the 83, 83 crew. Stuff, yeah. uh -huh. mm. And now they are all in different spheres of yeah, life. What are you doing? Um, yeah. So at this point, um, Carlos Alberto was part of it, right? No, Carlos wasn't part of it, but he just came to watch the show. Oh, okay, because yeah. Carlos in '83 was a big boy in this area, circle, yeah, circle area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was his own king yeah, here, king around it, yeah. <laughs> nice. And so, '83, you won Babylon, no, Babylon, uh, yeah, I won Babylon, but for yeah. it, uh, Caesar '83, uh, Reggie Rasto won. Well, but that was a little bit, you know. <laughs> but I've always said even that. Now, I, I, I've always, always, you know, I've always had my reservations what, about that one. Yeah, yeah. Because Charlie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so. He knows what happened, so he always <laughs> tell me, you know, Charlie. I did something, you know. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. So, what song did you use with Caesar 83? Uh, uh, sorry, Babylon 83. Babylon 83, that was it. Uh, I think jam on it. I can't remember the jam on it or something like that. Jam on it. Okay. I jam on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It 83. It was the 84 was that, that I started using the mixing, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Jam on it. Jam on it was all galaxy. No, no, no. Light years away. Light. Uh -huh. Light years away, yeah. Uh -huh. Light years away. Because after you, mm -hmm. a lot of dancers started using that. Yes, light years away. Yeah. And then they used to do the moonwalk moon with it and, and all those things. But do you remember some of those? Steps that oh, so is. Still there, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow! So you did that, and then uh, when you went to Babylon, uh, sorry, um, Caesar eighty three. Caesar eighty three. You remember some of the, the the people who were part of that too? Yeah, I just mentioned the Caesar eighty three. It was the eighty four that uh, the eighty three was Raju Rackstone and the rest of them. Okay, but then the eighty four was Alex. I think Alex Ofuri. No, no, wait, no, wait, last was no Donata. Uh, Sir Robot is now Sir Robot, yeah. Sir Robot, uh, Terry Fossil Bride at Legon. Legon now. is now, mm -hmm. you know, lecturer at Legon, yeah. And then who else? Slim Jean, there was a Slim guy called Jean. Slim Jean, yeah. but then Slim Buster was him, you know. No. But then we have Slim Jean, yeah. Slim Jean was there, policeman was there, policeman was there too, policeman yeah. But he there. also traveled, he also traveled, yeah. Yeah, yeah. after I did. 84, policeman we left you know, early, yeah. 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 Um, and then you had, um, but. You mean Carlos wasn't part of that? Carlos wasn't part of it. Oh, okay. He just came to watch it. Yeah. Oh, so he was just watching. But, uh, you know, the point is that in '84, most of them know that I'm, you know, anytime I'm you coming out there, with the, you know, uh, I'm happy. coming out with, they know, you know, they are, they are like they are in my camp because yeah, from '84, uh, what do you call it? From '84, we have to do, you know, a, a program that come from outside, like Tamale, Takrade, whatever. Yeah. They always come for me, and then yeah. I have to choose. Okay, I'm. I don't want to go alone. I like so to go with go this with guy, this guy. guy, this guy. Even Reggie Rakso was part of me. So yeah. if I say, okay, I'm going with Reggie, I will go with this. So they all know what I, you know, I'm capable, yeah. I'm capable of doing. Yeah. So they know the kind of music I will use. So let me say, Reggie Rakso was part of 84. But yeah. when he gets to the finals, he knows this, what I'm, the music I'm going to use was like, oh, Charlie. And I'm not, you know, because you are, you are going to use that stuff. <laughs> then I'm not going there. Part of it, you know, wow. Yeah. So most of them, they were part of it. I mean, we call it Pilames. Semi-finals and whatever, but when it gets to the finals, some of them started. So I remember one at Apollo Theater. Mm -hmm. Remember? Yeah, Apollo Theater was maybe 85. Something. 85. Yeah, 85. Okay. Uh, how about Tiptoe? Tiptoe, yeah. 80, within 84 going 85, 84, yes. 85 yeah. Yeah, Tiptoe, yeah, Apollo Theater. Apollo Theater. Yeah. Did you ever do Spark Center? Spark Center, yeah. Spark, was, Spark Center was like 83. Yeah, I want Spark Center. Yeah, I don't know. It was Spark Center. There was one King Solomon. Did you ever King do Solomon. King Solomon? I mean, those days, any club in the country or any sport that Sports you know, there's that a we used to call it. You know, those days, you know, uh, what do you call it? Uh, let me put it this way. 
uh, the uh, musicians were not that popular. No, 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 no. Nobody but wanted then, to hear, you know, especially band music. Yeah, it wasn't part, it of, wasn't the part game, of the man. game. It was like Skyhawks or whatever. Skyhawks. Like so that's the competition everywhere, everywhere. In every corner. And from 84, after, 80, after 684, any competition that goes on, you know, I always collect my money. I don't, you hear that I'm part of the competition, but Charlie, that's when I started making money because I'm like, because of me, people come to the program. Yeah. So I won't be just doing the program. I mean, yeah. just come and dance and go to you know, win the yeah. prize or whatever. But I, before you, I'll be on the program, you have to start paying me, you know. So I'll be in the competition. You might think, you know, I'm part of the competition, but Charlie, I'm getting my dough. Because the points that I remember is that people actually indeed came because of you. Yeah. And um, when it became very um, tough between, for me, my top three has, mm -hmm. had always been Ajit Siswa, Reggie, and mm -hmm. uh, Alex Ofori. Alex Ofori, yeah, um, Alex was my boy, yeah. Because Alex was your yeah, boy, yeah, because yeah. I remember, um, I remember coming to see you with, with, with uh, Patuna around yeah. the Christian Methodist. Christian Methodist, yeah. Christian that Methodist, area. yeah. That's, you used uh, to live we, somewhere. Yeah, we used there. to live there. That's uh, what you call Robert House. Robert most of, House. Most of the dancers used know, to be there. Yeah, used to be there. So, so the, the name Robert House is. Oh, how, how, what, so, what happened to Alex? <laughs> is he around? He's still around. He's still He's around. around. Are you in touch yeah. with him? Of course, you know. I'm trying to take care of him. I'm taking care of him right now. Wow. God bless you. God bless you. Okay. Hey, we'll come back to um, Ajete Soa. And um, when we come back, we'll go back to Caesar 84, Caesar 83, and some of the moves that he used to do. Those of you who have come on top that you think you know how to dance, this man is going to put you to your right position. This is still footprint. I'm old, old. <laughs> <laughs> No. The pace was a bit faster uh -huh. but we know what to do uh -huh. we'll be right back after this break <laughs> welcome back to the program this is footprint on city tv my name is samuel atamens and i'm here with ajete soa the dancer and this man the footprint that he has he has uh, left it will be very difficult for anybody to to copy exactly what he did in my estimation I think that you are Ghana's best ever dancer that we've seen. I mean, there are good dancers around, but I, I, I am, in my own opinion, thinking that what you did in the 80s and uh, running up to the late 80s mm. is something that will be difficult to just wipe off. And that's why I'm excited. And those are the days that you see how people are so spirited when it comes to um, the Barcelona's and the Manchester United's and uh, that's how we were so we were so mad about about the dancing competitions. Competition, yeah. I mean, I used to travel anywhere to just to watch dancing, dancing competition, competition yeah. and every weekend we used to look forward to it. Mm -hmm. And so, those of you who never saw him now, you are seeing him feely feely. Mm -hmm. I just saw so he's still alive mm -hmm. and doing well. I just you now talking about some of those songs that uh, they, they had a lot of electronic introductions yeah. into the end and it gave you the opportunity to express yourself in different ways now we talk about babylon and you remember the song that you you you, you use is 83 83 yeah, yeah. Uh, 83. which one again is it? The, what do you call it uh, is it light is away light is away, yeah. light is away. Black, yeah. we just want you to give us some small <laughs> what you <laughs> <laughs> just small one so i'll do this one let me move the chair so Ajete is going to do it for us you know just show them how we used to do it back in the day you said we used to do it, so you start oh no no <laughs> <laughs> no me i was never a dancer but you know because of the the skill that you had and how you know so you can show us and then i'll follow you understand? just a little bit yeah Okay, so <laughs> actually, this is the one I use for the word that's going to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. That's right. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> you put me in a spot. <laughs> This is what we miss. I just, this yeah, is but then I have to go down. Is that no, you don't have to. You don't have no, to. Because because that would be too much. Beach, yeah, yeah that would be too much. Okay, so we'll do the last one. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. 
Because back, you know, you have to listen to the beat and you dance with the beat. You don't really dance with the sound. Okay. I mean, we, you use the beat, not the lyrics. Okay. Yeah, so, so there's a beat. Back in the day, because you it's more electrical, you know, electronic, you know. So you have to use the electronic distance to not the lyrics. Okay. Mm. And 30 years down the line, mm. you still remember? Yeah, some of them. You remember some of some them? Of them yeah. So, okay. So, 84... And then we got to 85. Remember some of the um, contests that you took part in 85? Like I said, from 84, after 84, all the contests I took part, it's like business. You know, then we used to have all manner of dances, you know, although the pros, the professionals like Ajete, uh, Reggie, they had their own um, skillful way of expressing themselves. So 82, 83, um, we had the Mezop, that's the dance form called Mezop, and then uh, after Mezop, which one? Ulman Boogie, Ulman Boogie, Ulman Boogie, and then push it, it, in order, you know. uh, uh, push, it push it, yeah, push it, and then there was one called Bodgers, Bodgers, yeah. <laughs> So, so I say, we have to go through some of those for the younger ones to understand. Oh, for the club one, you are the best. So. At this time, we had. Um, function or event spots in different communities so you go to dance so man you had king solomon, king solomon. you came to koko Mlemle, you have spark center latebi okoshi had um a very popular one popular in latebi yeah, okoshi yeah. and then teshi teshi la, uh, what do you call it guessing guessing yeah. and then oh, la, stereo sports stereo sports yeah, stereo uh, sport, yeah. sport. and then so Every community, if you go to Kumasi, they had their own. Yeah. And I remember even Akimodan, they had their own. Mm -hmm. And these were sports. Now, after the sports, you have the clubs. Mm -hmm. And um, you had the likes of KTK. KTK. You have Black Caesar's Black Palace. Caesar. You had Babylon uh, before, right? What they call it? Uh, Sid. Sid Kubari's place. Sid. Sid Kubari's place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Funky yeah. Town. Funky Town. Funky Town. You have Funky Town in Jowulu. And all those places. But some of the songs and the dance forms like Mezop, Mezop uh, Ulman Boogie, Boogie, and uh, you know, uh, which push it, is, push it, push it, push it, and then Bodgers. Bodgers, <laughs> yeah, Bodgers. Yeah. So I guess he's going to teach us some of those ones. No, I you guess. are supposed to teach us. Oh, no. <laughs> you are the dancer. <laughs> you are the dancer. So you teach me <laughs> and then I follow. So you are the teacher and I follow. Let me see so, if I can remember some of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Ulman Boogie. Let's start Ulman with Ulman Boogie, for okay. instance. So Charlie, drop the sound. Drop the sound. Man, Ulman Boogie. Yeah. Okay, Ulman Boogie. Is good Ulman right Boogie. Now. Back in the day. So let's move another one. Uh, <laughs> so that was Ulman Bugi. Ulman Bugi. Let's go to Mezop. Oh, so we go to Mezop. Mezop. But I think Mezop just reflect. You know, came back. You know, some two years ago. Uh, they were doing it. You know, back. but they didn't get it like we we did. Okay, you know. Mezop. So let's change the song now. Yeah. So we are doing Mezop, right? Yeah, Mezop. Mezop. Charlie, can I do the Mezop? Charlie, canto, canto, four. Crazy myself, crazy myself, 
was it. Yeah. That was and it. Then we have, uh, so, and then we have Mezzo. I forgot the name, but then we have Push. And then they have a panel. Something like that, but yes. I can And somehow, somehow, know. most of these dances used to come from the Cape Coast area. Yeah. You know, these Cape Coast schools, you know, a panel, Anyo. Yeah, Anyo. They have something for Anyo. Anyo was. I forgot Anyo. I can hear I forgot, but I. Something like that. Something. No, then we have the waves too. The waves. The waves. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. 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 And then we have. Um, so. Cut the cake. Okay. Cut the cake. It goes like this. I remember that one. I remember that one. Yeah. I remember that one. But I mean, but the last one uh -huh. was Bodgers. Bodgers. Mm. But just say, eh, I don't remember it. It's, it's, I don't remember it. But, <laughs> but just. 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 Yeah. Oh, man. Oh. Charlie. That was good. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, we forgot to push it. Push it. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. This. Give us. Okay, so Charlie, right now, you, you know that we have some moves still left in our system, Charlie. Mm. That's what we say. Okay, so we'll be taking a short break. When we come back, we'll look at his life after 85 and now. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the program. This is uh, Footprint and uh, we've been talking to Ajete Soa and his Charlie Deman has caused me to do some exercise, but uh, no be easy. Mm. But hey, let me, let me bring my stuff back here. Good, Ajete. Mm -hmm. So, after all the Black Caesars Palace and uh, Babylons and all those places, then we heard of the world dance champions mm. how did you get yourself into that okay in 85 like i said uh just after o level i left to london the same night i left to london so when i got there because jiman did uh i think 84 the uh, malibu the malibu, malibu the, the yeah so i was like okay that's my next target too so 85 i went to london get myself into registration i really start for ghana you know i have to show them some a clip videos that show that i'm a a champion of Ghana or whatever, so I did that. So I, I think I presented my this thing a little bit late, so they put me on 86. So I was 80, 86. number 86. No, no, no. For for the year 86. Oh, 86. I couldn't okay. compete uh, oh, okay. 85. So you're 86. Yeah, I couldn't compete 85. So I have to join. I have to do the next one. That's 86. So that's how I got myself into the world that's a mm -hmm. for the 86 yeah and 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 so you you stayed in london but then i was year. yeah i was staying in london since from 85 i was staying in london okay and you prepared for the 86 yeah, I, yeah, I prepared for the and 86. how did that go what kind of how did you occupy yourself preparing for this event well you know like i said uh when there were you know i have a but then i have a uh, a fellow friend who's also a dancer coming from philippines so but then we used to dance in the clubs Okay. You know, in okay. the London clubs, we used to dance in the clubs, so that's where. So it gets to a point that uh, 86, around 86, that I started getting ready for the competition. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, what was your expectation getting into that competition? Well, for me, dance finals. For me, it was just like, you know, just to get to the finals. Because normally, to show the video, I mean, to show the whole show around the world, it's only the finals that they show. They don't show the the preliminaries, the semi-finals, and everything. So I was like, okay, for me, I just want to get to the finals so that you know, at least Ghana will see me see doing that, something. Yeah. yeah. Because so how did look, that go? Tell me about the the qualification, the preliminary. The preliminary, I think we were about thirty, no, sixty something, and then they have to go till down to thirty-two. Mm. For the funnels, you know, and they were all from different countries. All from different countries. So mm -hmm. it was thirty-two that competed. And where was this? Yeah. Where that was in London. Yeah. Where? Um, you don't uh, remember? Hammersmith. No, no, Hammer okay. Empire, Empire Ballroom. Okay. Empire Ballroom. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Empire Ballroom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so you had the prelims. We had the prelims, but the prelims we did it different club. They have different, you know, venues. Yeah. Hammersmith, Empire Ballroom, and then other places here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
but the finals was uh, at the uh, Empire Ballroom. Okay. Yeah. And um, you went to the prelims and then you moved to the next so level? To the next level, to the semi finals, to the finals. So that's my, my, like I said, my target was just to be in the finals yeah. because that's where they always show the. Um, the and this uh, was within um, one week, two weeks, one month? One week. One week? Yeah, within one wow. week. Wow. Yeah. And you kept going. It was going. like nine days, yeah, one week. Two you weeks. kept going. You kept, I kept going. going. I kept going. And then one um, day you found yourself yeah. in the final. In the final. And, and how many like, okay, of you were that's, there? I, I, I'm like, I'm there. <laughs> Remember the, the participants and the countries that qualified for the finals? I mean, US, US was part of it. Belgium, UK, Germany, Iceland. Mm hmm uh netherland mexico uh, yeah I'm, i i it, it was 32 that qualified 32 finalists, 32 finalists yeah. and i remember there were females females yeah there were, there were females, females yeah. in the finalists yeah, doing all kinds of things <laughs> <laughs> some okay. people were almost half naked crap <laughs> oh yeah yeah. Thing, yeah yeah at the time yeah because for me that was the first time i saw something like that i was like oh okay so people can come on stage with you know all kinds of yeah, you're not, you know, used, to we're not, Ghana, back here, we're not used to that. Back here, we're not used to that. Before you go and stay with that, it's like, hey. <laughs> okay, so. But you know, you can see, I mean, they are part or whatever, but they have something that covers everything. Okay. But, I mean, from. I mean, but watching it was still it, you provocative. Might think, yeah, you might think, yeah, they are naked or something. Okay, so 32 countries represented. Yeah. And um, did you get to watch the people ahead of you before it was your turn? Uh, what do you call it? Uh, during the semi-finals, there's a, uh, what do you call it? You are, you are backstage, so you can see what is going. You can see when it's not, before you, you come Not on turn, stage, yeah. you can see the next, you can see, before you go on stage, you see the next person mm -hmm. dancing. So you see what the person is doing and all that. You know, and they were doing all kinds of dances. And, um, well, I was, you know, for me, because I'm in the finals, and that's okay for me. You know, I okay. I'm like, okay, you know, just for Ghana to see me, you know, being part of it. That's all. That was it. So I wasn't thinking of, you know, winning or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then it was your turn. Yeah, it was my it was my turn. I have to do my turn. They announced your name loud. Loud, just like that. I, I get just you so from Ghana. Yeah, with my Ghana colors, you know, costume. Yeah, I just came out to do my turn. Were there any Ghanaians there with you? I can remember my uncle, who is my who was my manager. Then yeah. the wife. That's, I think that's. Mm -hmm. And then you got there, and then you remember which song? Like I said, I used my mixing song, which is, okay. you know, like 10 different artist songs. So I just, you know, put it together and then use it. Mm -hmm. But anytime I use that music, it's like I have the confidence. The energy. Like, yeah, I have the confidence. I say, hey, yeah, this time I can do this. So but this because it's a different country altogether, you are not I, so I, sure. I was like, okay, maybe, you know, maybe, you know, because. Good. They were into ballet and all those kinds of people. Well, I mean, so all kinds of, people were doing all kinds I of dancing. I mean, dance, so actually, like, you, you could think they were yeah. joking. I mean, yeah. they were just there to have fun. Yeah. Yeah. And some two took it very seriously. Yeah. Yeah. Especially the South Most of them were, yeah, yeah. No, no, they were not just, just there to have fun. They were there to, you know, to win. To win. But for me, just to be in the final, just to, you know. Okay, so... Because I was like, oh, no, for Africa to win, Charlie. You know. It won't happen. It won't happen. So let me do it just... For Ghanaians to see me that yeah. You too, you did yeah, that song. I did that song, yeah. Okay. And then you went. Mm -hmm. So from 32, they waited down to eight. Eight finalists. And I was the last one. I don't know how they did, but then I was the last eight. I don't know called. whether whether you know you are to, in, supposed in to be the first in a particular order or whatever, but I was the last one for the eight finalists. So you know. They now could, they started calling they you started back. Started calling calling back. And I was the la I mean the eight two, I was the last dancer to, to, to perform. To perform. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that was good. And how was the response, the crowd response? I mean, with the crowd alone, because I think because of the mixing, because, they, you know, most of them, they haven't seen the kind of, and the dancing I was doing, is most, most of my dance is like traditional dance mix, blend with, you know, yeah, like Western. Panlogo move, some of the Panlogo moves that I, I try to, you know, blend it a little, westernize, it, westernize it a little bit to fit in. So, uh -huh. I mean, they were happy because the way, I moved by every bit. Every well bit, choreographed. Every, yeah, well choreographed, yes. Mm -hmm. yeah, so that's, I think that's what they like. And so yeah, when yeah. you finished, when you did your performance... When I did my performance, the crowd were like, and I was like, yeah. 
you are getting there. Yeah, I'm there. You are getting there. Not I'm getting there. I'm there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah. so at which point? But at, at, at that, around that time, still I wasn't thinking. You know, you know, I'm like, okay, I'm there. You know, Ghana, Ghana, Ghana have seen me. That's all. All right. Mm. So at which point did you notice that it was it was coming back to you? Just after my dance, I mean, backstage, almost all the dancers were like, Charlie. Charlie, this thing you are going to win, you know, you know, most of the, almost all because we, uh, let me say, uh, we have a uh, what do you call it? They have to organize a, what do you call the best costume, best behavior, whatever it is, mm -hmm. and then uh, I mean I, I was given the best behavior, whatever. It is. Mm -hmm. So after that, you know, the, some of the guys were like, Charlie, that performance was Charlie, you can do this, you know. I'm like, oh yeah, uh, you guys are just you know, yeah, making fun of me or whatever. And then all of a sudden the call US. U no 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 uh, UK was third. UK was third. Okay. Then they call US second. You know, I'm like, oh Charlie. I'm not. Then all of a sudden Ghana should uh, Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> Your heart didn't miss a beat. Yeah. Like, yeah. When they called Ghana, I was like, you know, I, I thought it was and then the guys were Charlie's you, 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 you. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, yeah, I just ran to And you quickly it. rushed there. Oh, yeah, I just rushed. And then I realized that you got there and then you did the dance again. Yeah, yeah, we have to repeat that. After, you know, the winner have to repeat the dance. Uh -huh. So I did everything back again. And then the others joined you. Yeah, yeah. All the dancers joined me. Joined just, you. Yes, just to finish the whole thing, finally. Nice. Yeah, that was big. And that was big at the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this time, Charlie. So after that, what happened to Ajiti Soa? After just after Malibu, uh, what do you call it? I had a contract to uh, Switzerland for a Switzerland. year. Okay, oh, okay, for a year. So I stayed in Switzerland for a year. I was uh, performing with a group called the Acro Mechanicals. They were doing more acrobat, and I was doing the hip hop freestyle stuff. So we blended together, and then you know, we started performing. And uh, what do you call it, Switzerland for a year? So after a year, I came back home. Mm -hmm. You know, set up a group. Yeah, Ajit is in the dance. dance. The dance factory? The no, dance. No, no. The dance factory came later. Okay. Ajit is in the dance. Mm -hmm. So we started performing almost everywhere in the country. Then before, later on, National Theatre mm -hmm. called me to, you know, be artistic director at the National Theatre. So that's where, not, you know, most of the dancers that I was dancing with, I uh, brought them into... Okay. Uh, I brought them to National Theatre and then we changed their name to... Uh, what do you call it? Before the, uh, the, uh, there was a group there already called the Yaps, which uh, I think the name wasn't in. So I just changed the name to Dance Factory. Mm -hmm. So I did this one, the Dance Factory. Which year was this? That was ninety six. Ninety six. Okay. Yeah, so you're still in Ghana in ninety six. Yeah, I was. Yeah, uh, I came back. So for for I think for a year or something like that, I left. Okay. And then you went where? To the US. You went to the US. Yes. So did you close the chapter on dancing when you got to the US? No, no, no. I was still, because I was teaching dance, you know, mo okay, in the U.S. most of the time I was teaching African dance. All right. African, traditional dance and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. I have a studio where, you know, people, people pay for it that are, you know, pay, uh, uh, what do you call it, two hours. Okay, dance so they pay section. hourly they pay rates, they come so and then you do that, yeah. Okay. So when did you finally come back to Ghana? It's been 11 years now. Oh, you've been here for 11 years? 11 years, yeah. Wow. But just behind the scenes just relax doing your own thing yeah doing my own thing so I'm, so I'm what into, do you do now right now i'm into real estate okay yeah. but then i uh, just just uh what do you call a couple of uh let me say a couple of months ago i, I tried to bring up dance, the dance. In the dance i don't think you should stop this dancing mm. thing i mean it's i you. was thinking of you know living it for the youth because they no, are, you know, i mean we have good dancers out there it's but just that they need People to organize just like exactly. they used to do back in the days, you know. But then you can see they have, you know, we have good dancers out there. Yes, people yeah. are skillful, but yeah. some of them they need direction yeah. and and instruction, That's you know, because uh, there's only one Ajete mm. uh -huh. Oh, there are more Ajete Soa out there, but just you know, they need. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cool. So. Yeah. Um, you, you you say you're now into uh, real, estate. real estate so estate what, what was that about you sell houses buy and sell, yeah, buy and sell oh okay yeah. so that's that's serious business yeah, that's serious. yeah people buy houses yeah Ghanaians have money yeah 
Mm-hmm. That's my name. <laughs> or, they, or you sell to Nigerians. <laughs> no, no, no. It, it doesn't matter whether it, it, Nigerians or foreigners or whatever. Once they are buying, it wasn't selling, selling. Okay, so Ajete, now looking back, looking back, what kind of advice would you want to give to the youth? Um, okay, that's just like I said. Uh, I just regret, you know, take, not taking my education that serious. Because it gets to a point, sometimes you need to express yourself in a way, but then, you know, I think that's where I'm a little bit down by, by the grace of God. So what I advise, they should stay out of drugs and then also be focused, whatever they are doing, whatever talent you are doing. You, you know, we, 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 we actually, well, it's, it's a serious point that you just raised mm-hmm. about this uh, drugs because, um, I mean, you were, you were at the highest point, mm-hmm. but um, I, I don't think that at any point anybody could point finger at Ajete Soa um, within no, that no, you know no. area. I mean but I have a couple of friends that do that you know yeah, that's say. what I'm saying that but then a lot of I them don't fell know, maybe down. because of my upbringing my mother my father they are, you know the Christianity yeah. so because of that you know I strong still hands strong, at home even though I'm the guy smoking doing all kinds of I've never tried you've never tried no no never tried, you know, never tried weed or anything nothing. you've never, never tried weed even drinking you know alcohol no so you never drank alcohol, no, hard drank liquor. Alcohol. The la- uh, I remember uh, what was that? That wasn't my intention. But then uh, back in the days, Lincoln. Okay, maybe that's the reason why I didn't uh, try what they call alcohol because uh, Lincoln. We have a one of our you know uh, school member want to die or whatever. So we have to go there and perform during the funeral whatever. And then I was feeling thirsty, so there was a. Uh, but those days, it's not like pure water or whatever. They yeah. sell the water in the bottle. Yeah, 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 stuff like that. So there was a bottle there. I thought it was just a water. No, no, it was aquatation, you know. So I just took it when I drank it, you know, before I realized, Charlie. So what happened to me, I'm like, Charlie, I've never touched. So since then, I've never touched alcohol. Okay, so you yeah. didn't drink alcohol yeah, didn't and drink you never alcohol. smoked? Smoked, no way. You know. Really? Never. Wow. Never, never. But all the boys used all to the, do... All the guys, before going on stage, they have to... And I'm like, Charlie, you guys, you know, I mean, they are trying to work in your... You know, that thing will work in your body or whatever. But then they are like, oh, try it, Charlie, it's good. I'm like, Charlie, I can do it okay. without it. So, so you pass I? through, yeah. you know, and so you are, yeah. in a, you are in a good place to advise yeah. the young yeah. ones. Yeah. yeah. But the main point is the education, I think. They should take it seriously. Just like my kids, I make sure that, you know, they don't get involved good. with those things. Yeah. Right. Are you Even though some of them... Used to, you know, but okay. Then, but yeah. you have how many kids do you have? Uh, six, six of them. Six, yeah. How many boys? How many girls? Four boys, two girls. Ages, ages 30. First one, 30, 30. You know, you know, I used to. <laughs> 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 but they're not, they're not in the country, they are in the US. I'm mean, here with only one kid. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So you have one 30 year, two 30 year olds, two 30, the third one, 29. The uh, oh, you were in a hurry, man. I mean, like I said, not with one, not with one. Anymore. Yeah, I mean, that's where you can you can get me, you know. Because I, I, no, 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 I'm, days, not, you know, I'm not looking for you to yeah. get you. I mean, that's a, a friend said to me that you know, he said, so you, you, if if you don't smoke, you don't you don't drink. Mm. And I don't like watching TV, so that's the only thing. They say that Charlie, it could be a couple Me back uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, but but good thing is that um, you are taking good care of mm, them, yeah, and yeah. and that's most yeah. important. And 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 I'm very proud of you. Mm. I'm very very proud of you. And uh, we've been talking about you, myself, uh, mm. and EMO, and, and and the rest of the guys. And it's good to have you back and mm. doing what you're doing. Thank you. Thank so you. I want to thank you for coming. And, thank you very uh, much. Yeah, I'm sure that we'll invite you again to CCTV okay. to do other things, other things with right. us uh, now that you live in Ghana. Oh, yeah, you know. In you're coming here, Jana. Jana And also, right now, I have a dance agency whereby, you know, dance, you know we do you dance dances, and we do uh, what performances. Call, like, video shoots and stuff like that. For, oh, okay. If you really want dances, I have people okay. like that. And so, performance too, we do that as well. So now, this is what runs a dance agency so he he has performers for functions and i'm talking about uh, serious functions nice one yeah. uh, serious functions that we have 
and then um, anything you want to Ajete, mm. if you, you you get to us, we'll find a way of mm. um, connecting you to Ajete so on. This is where we wrap up. Thank you very much for joining us. It's been the Footprint. My name is Samuel Atamensa. See you next week. <laughs>